everyone. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about testing solar panels using multimeters and also a clamp meter. So this is a, your standard multimeter. It can test for volts, amps, and different things. Um, and so you can just insert these probes right into the MC4 connectors on the panel when testing for that. Uh, when testing for volts, pretty straightforward. Testing for amps, whenever you do that, you're gonna have the probe inserted in this port here, and each meter is a little bit different, but they're, they're pretty similar. Um, and then on the multimeter, you have a COM port, which you're gonna use for testing volts. The biggest thing when testing for amps is to ensure that the panel doesn't have any sun on it. It should be covered. Uh, if you don't have that covered, then you can create a spark, either at the MC4 uh, connector or on the tester. So definitely be careful for that. And then when testing for amps using a clamp meter, uh, very easy. What you're gonna do is connect the MC4 connectors on the panel, and then go ahead and loop this around the cabling, and then set it to test for amps. And we'll demonstrate this outside in a minute. The, the most important thing when testing the panel is to make sure you have good sun, obviously nothing shaded on it, and ideally you're gonna be angling it towards the direct sunlight. Uh, the amperage can be greatly affected at the angle that you have the panel on. So if you just have it laying flat on the ground, it's going to affect the amount of amperage you see when testing for amps. All right, so let's go outside and go ahead and test up a panel. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and put positive probe in there, negative in there. Set our meter to volts. We're getting a readout right now of 34 volts approximately, which is right on par with what this panel will do. And so for amps, a little bit different. Go ahead and disconnect these. So for amps, what we're gonna do, connect the MC4 connectors there. I'm gonna change our here to amps loop it around and so right now we're getting about three amps not the best on today we're getting three amps and then you'll see once we un unclamp it here it goes back to zero okay so we're going to turn our meter to volts insert our probes here Good connection, getting about 33 volts. And when testing for amps, we've moved our probe over to the to the amp input. We'll switch it on. Make sure we have a good connection. Right now, we're getting about 2.2 amps. You can find more information about this and other products at SantanSolar.com, your one-stop shop for all your solar panel needs.